Hepatitis C is an infectious disease of liver caused by the hepatitis C virus. People with hepatitis B often have mild or no symptoms. Sometimes about occasionally a fever, 15-25% to of cases people clear from virus within 6 months. Symptoms may cause us. Dark urine, abdominal pain, nausea and vomiting, decreased appetite and weight loss, fever, muscle or joint pains, very rarely yellow skin. In most cases about 80% of those exposed to the virus develop a chronic infection. Hepatitis C incubation period is average, 6 to 7 weeks. Chronic hepatitis B causes fatty changes to the liver, liver cirrhosis, portal hypertension, ascites, accumulation of fluid in the abdomen, increased risk of dilated blood vessels in the esophagus and stomach, cognitive impairment known as hepatic encephalopathy. About 30% of infected develop cirrhosis over 30 years. Excess alcohol increases the risk of developing cirrhosis fivefold. And cirrhosis increases develop of hepatocellular carcinoma 20-fold times. Transmission. HCV is spread primarily by blood-to-blood contact associated with injection drug use, it is the major risk factor. Poorly sterilized medical equipment, needle stick injuries in healthcare, and transfusions. 10% chance to transmission mother to child during birth. Sexual transmission of hepatitis C is uncommon but possible. Especially if there is high levels of trauma. Between heterosexual partners, when one is infected and the other is not, have found very low risks. Personal care items such as razors, toothbrushes, and manicuring or pedicuring equipment can be contaminated with blood. Sharing such items can potentially lead to exposure to HCV. Diagnosis. Hepatitis C testing typically begins with blood testing to detect the presence of antibodies to the anti-HCV antibodies. The liver enzymes measured from blood samples are elevated but may be normal. In 7 to 53%. Screening for HCV infection is recommended in all adults age 18 to 79 years old. There is no vaccine against hepatitis C. Chronic infection can be cured more than 95% of the time with antiviral medications such as sofosbuvir or semeprevir. Those who develop cirrhosis or liver cancer may require a liver transplant. Those with chronic hepatitis C are advised to avoid alcohol and medications toxic to the liver. They should be vaccinated against hepatitis A and hepatitis B. Use of acetaminophen is generally considered safe at reduced doses. Coffee consumption has been associated with a slower rate of liver scarring in those infected with HCV.